GTI fans, welcome back to another episode of Empyrean Galactic Survival. This is your host, Zelot, and we are here today doing the Alpha 12 series. Um, so, decided to make this beach our home. Uh, so, this beach, you know, life is going to be a beach. That's, that's what I say. Um, let's get our menu items and stuff back here. You can see right now it's comfy cozy sitting at 41 degrees out, but that's going to start climbing really fast. This, this planet is voracious. It is hot. Um, although being a little bit further north of the equator is going to help a bit. Not a ton, but it will help. Uh, what we can also do is run into the water and put our heater cooler down in the water with us if we really have problems. So uh, hopefully we won't get to that stage. I built, what have I built here? I've got the base starter built and a whole bunch of concrete blocks. So I think what I need to do first is we're going to connect to the, uh, well, we are connected. I'm just going to reconnect. Just to make sure, because that would have been that would have been uh, my connection from previous save or from the save, right? So sometimes that's not all the reliable. I I always when you start up your game again, go into your when you load up a save, any connect anything you're connected to, disconnect and reconnect to it because it I don't know I I've had some funky experiences with it in the past where it doesn't behave correctly, so. Uh, do yourself a favor and reconnect to whatever container controller that you want to uh, have your your extra connector container connector I guess you want to call it is that what they call this I can't remember now <laughs> sorry um, okay so we now that we have our this connected we should be able to just put this stuff on our bar. Right? Um, that's not going to be able to fit 215. Wow. <laughs> okay. Well, 15. <laughs> that's not much. Let's put this down. So, oh, you know what? Let's go back into the tutorial and we're going to reactivate that, right? So let's do that. Let's go. So we got it equipped. It recognized that. That's good. Uh, I kind of want it in the water a bit. So can we just... Nope, wrong way. Ooh, that's too much. Can we just a, a smidge? Yeah, that's not bad. So if we... Uh, see, it, it comes forward. It bounced up when we came forward a bit. Um, I mean, I could make it so that right there and that way we don't have to dig a lot it'll go into the water and we will have to uh, you know we'll have to brace it in the water a bit put it down a little bit I want to just let's do that actually let's just put it here that's fine that's fine and then what we're gonna do uh, yeah now it wants us to power it up how about we throw some blocks around it first? That's why I didn't want to go go too low because you can see how how as we come inland here, and I'm gonna have to move all that equipment. I realize that it's just for now. Get this up. Okay, so we should be able to just keep um, grabbing blocks. Let's see how many it'll let us take. 16 this time, because we don't have the... Uh, why is it not take, you know, 300? What do I... Oh, you know what? Here. I've got some heavy stuff on me. I don't need that on me. I don't necessarily need that on me. What else? This stuff, I don't need that. Oh, 
Oh, look at all that water. I don't need that. There we go. I'm like, it's got to be something else really crippling me here. Okay. So now we should be able to grab... Well, that's not going to help because that's in this. Um, but now what I can do, I can help out by grabbing that. And that's 25. Yeah, that's 150, 90, 90, 180. I can't carry anymore. Uh, no, okay. Well, that helps out. So we should be able to carry more now. I didn't notice that I had that so full that um, I actually had better carrying capacity. So you know what we can do? Because I'm being an idiot. You know, as usual, let's just throw this stuff into the constructor. And it doesn't take up any weight. And then we'll just come back into here. We'll put this on our bar, throw this in the constructor too. Uh, here we go. And that way. We should be able to put way more. Well, pff, 10. Yeah. <laughs> really? Yeah, uh, it's those 26 blocks are taken up. Uh, yep. Yep. Okay. Well, it's more than what we can carry on our own person. So, uh, better than not doing it. And you can see that the temperature now is into the area where if we weren't beside our heater cooler, we'd actually start getting hot, even though it's foggy out. So, this, this planet is brutal. I'm going to launch the drone, and we can uh, put these blocks down. Okay, so, here, let's just... Bring this right out. I need to get a uh, a cargo box down right away, and then I can actually link to the cargo box, uh, and that'll carry whatever sixteen thousand, right? So. Um, I mean, I could do that right now. What I should do is put that down right now. Now that I think about it. So let's do that. I grab this. Grab these. Since you don't have to have it powered, right? Let's put this down. Um, I mean, that's obviously not going to be the core. Well, it might be. That's actually getting. Yeah, I mean, we can put. Here, yeah, okay. So let's do this. Spin that. Put that there for now. I know we got to put more blocks around it to create a wall, but that's fine. Put that down there. Okay, so now we should have access to those to connect to. So what we can do now, instead of using the hover vehicle that only has the 2,000, um, we should be able to change this now. Let's put this okay, to box 5. That should be fine. Okay, and then I'm going to connect to box 5 now and re-put this on my bar now that it's going to box 5. And here, grab some more. And we should be able to put, like, the whole stack in now. Yeah, there we go. And the reason why I, I can do it without touching it is because I'm within the boundaries of the baseline now. The baseline is a square, so it doesn't take into account chunks that are missing out of the base. It's whatever 
whatever block extends out in each direction, north, east, south, and west, and it creates a square out of that. So I'm within its square, so I can I have Wi-Fi capable connection, uh, even though I don't have a Wi-Fi attached or power or anything. Um, so from here, let's pay attention so I don't uh, do something stupid. Launch my drone, and now we have access to the whole stack. There we go. So from here, we can really, you know, get a lot of, oops, get a lot of the base construction done quickly with a bigger stack. And, you know, quick, quick as a relative term, by who is the uh, controller, by the way. <laughs> okay. Oh, come on. It's, it drifts. The, um... The drone does drift, and it's a pain in the ass to build it. Okay, so what? What? Why can't we put one there? There's got to be something there. So there's like um. There was a rock or something there, I bet, wasn't there? And it's invisible now. So if we change to our drill mode on the survival tool and and see what happens here. Okay, well, let's see if we can place a block. No. Um, there's got to be something right there that's went invisible. <laughs> it's still an alpha. Yes, this is the stable branch, but by no means. Oh, I, I heard something there. Did you hear that? It was. It sounded like it was hitting a rock. There we go. Come on. Did did we hit a rock? Did we break the rock? A container. Rock. Oh. Okay. Let's uh. <laughs> Oh, you dirty bugger. Really? Um, here. Uh, I don't want to log off and log back in. Let's resolve this invisibly. It's got to be here. See, it says container. Rock drill. Container. Why does it say container? Oh. Rock. Drill hit points 48. Here we go. There we go. As I make a complete disaster out of my side of my wall there. Great. It's okay. I can I can pave over that, which I intend to. So uh, okay, we should be able to put a. <laughs> there we go. Okay. You, you know what? I will do that right now. Get rid of that ugly. Uh, one more and will let me yes nice okay so there's not as much block collision as there was in uh, one of the versions of the experimental there was a you couldn't even you couldn't do that you wouldn't have been able to put that down like this you would have to dig out a whole bunch so they've they fixed that that's awesome because that was really annoying it created really ugly lines Okay, um, well, that's fine. So should we extend out a little bit? We can do that. I'm going to reposition the... the um, so... I, I'll reposition the core later. It's just... Now, if I pick up everything and move it... Don't necessarily have to right now. Let's uh, uh, I don't have any. Oh, yeah, I do. I have my multi tool, don't I? Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Okay, so I can pick those up and move them. No problem. Okay, good. 
good because I'll have to do that because that was a stupid place to put them <laughs> but that's fine okay so what are we looking at we want um, what am I what am I doing here like you know am I uh, am I making a tower am I keeping it square am I going like barn shaped sort of with like a uh, a hangar bay underneath with a little like apartment on top and then under and then and then dig down underneath that for like the shop and and garden maybe it's not a bad idea uh, and have because this this doesn't have to be a massive base it just has to get us started so what do we got so far we've got one two three four five six seven eight nine ten ten does not do me any good i do not like things that are even um so yeah we've got to change that that's got to come out more is that going to clip yep okay so let's let's move this we're going to cook to death here doing it Oops. Wrong button. Okay, so if we move this over. You know what? We can get it right up on top now. Can we? Oh, maybe not. <laughs> okay, let's try this again. Over this side. Come on. Get up there. There we go. Now, why isn't it docking? It should be do Oh, you know why? You know why, I bet? You know why? Yeah, that's why. Okay. There we go. So now, um, i got to pick this stuff up. And we have a constructor. We've got the solar panels. So let's, let's take some oxygen before I suffocate. And oh, we're getting, we're getting low on food. We might have to go for a swim. That might not be a bad idea. Let's finish the pad off. And maybe go for a swim to finish off the episode just to just to show you what it's like swimming down in the ocean and picking some seaweed yeah okay so let's grab we still got all that in the base that's fine and we're gonna overheat really quick here I'm gonna overheat so let's connect to the base now and continue dumping stuff into the base. So if we grab what we can of the little stuff, I'll grab the bigger stacks and put them on the connected to. I should be able to grab the rest of this. It's just quicker. And I'm out of space, so that's fine. We'll just plunk these down. And we're not going to have enough slots. That's fine. Okay. And we'll just dump all this stuff in there. disconnect to dump the rest that's in our bar and just reconnect it's a little faster and then grab that last that's it okay and then what do we got in here we had biofuel oh it was turned off <sighs> okay well 
<laughs> oh, uh, we'll turn you on and clear you. There you go. Okay, we should be able to pick these up now without anything falling out. And what do we got here? Very nice. But I'm going to grab you. And we're going to be moving you. And you. Okay, we got to get you. Let's move you out here. Move all this crap. Whoa, uh, scared the bejesus out of me. Okay, let's put this down before we cook to death. And now we'll put the rest of our stuff down. Uh, oh, I'm going to lose remote connection, whatever. Did I lose remote connection? Nope, doesn't look like it. Okay. Oh, and I'm still within, <laughs> barely, but still within reach of that. So let's put this down now, and it's buddy. That's fine. Okay. Um, we got to get the tent out of the way. No, I don't want to sleep. I just want to grab it. Okay, we'll put that down. There we go. We got our nice little camp set up again beside our construction site. And we got to get that going. So let's do that. We'll just, you know what? That's fine. Okay. Um,. Oh, yeah, let's see. Okay, here, let's move this a little closer then. That's better. Okay, so now we should be able to reconnect now that we got everything there and get the pad laid out. And actually, you know what? You know what? Here, let's go back in and put the rest of these on here too. Might as well. Get it uh, charging. Okay. So we want to do this with the drone. Tab in, tab out to get my um, radar back. Let's just finish filling this in here. Okay, so is that 10 wide or 11? I want 11. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. And 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. And one more. 11. 11 by 11. Okay, I should make I should be able to do something with this. On the eleven by eleven, I can put a either a nine by six or a nine by five door in. That's huge. That would basically take up the entire width of it. You know what? We should have side rooms too then. Maybe I will have some uh, maybe it'll slope up, kind of like a barn. Slope up with side rooms. Yeah. But maybe we won't do the the 9 by 5 We can do a 7 by 5 I think. Okay, so let's Let's start by putting in some of these. And we'll bring them up. I mean, it's a, at least going to be five high to the, to the next level anyway. Five and three, four. Five. Okay. Um, 
Where do we want our front, back, sides? Do we want to come in off the water? I kind of actually want to come in right where we are because it's so low, right? Come into it right here. So I can remove. Uh, I'll, I'll move these. I'll move these. Okay, that was really loud. You're freaking me out, dude. Um, and if we're going to have side rooms that come out, that flare out, so, so this will be, so we're still going to have more. It's going to have more. Um, well, really, why not a nine by five, right? Fill the entire thing with a door okay so that's where the door is going to go we can punch doors through the rest of these walls later I'm going to hold down control and create the whole wall at once if I have the I don't, I don't think I have the uh, blocks oh I do I know it's going to be just a just a box right now but um i have plans i have plans i really would like to put windows here and these this might eventually get punched out for windows uh oh you know what there's only 15 left here let's just oh, did you not lay no okay so yeah we're out we're out we need more no surprise that was not enough we need to get more rocks. Well, we also need plant protein. And we need more levels. So why don't we do a quick, okay, fill up on all of our stuff here. And then I'm going to dump this stuff into there. 62, okay. Uh, okay, so now let's get, let's get the, I'm going to hit N, do connect to base. And then we want to... So that's going to be back corner, back corner. You know what? I'm just going to throw this down here right, right now really quickly. Perfect. We can move it later. I just want to get some, uh, some juice going. So let's choose the flat ones here. And we'll just, uh, and these will get moved later also. Just want to find somewhere where it's going to sit okay. And okay, so we finished that part of the Robson protocol on to the next stage, which is add the constructor and cargo container. Just want to get these down here so that we can start charging the base. Okay. Now let's take a look at the stats of it really quick here. Um, oh, we're, we're going to get attacked in less than 10 days already. Really? Damn. <laughs> well, screw you. We just laid the freaking thing down. Ugh. That's tragic. <laughs> that sucks. Why? Only 34% rep 20 location. It's fairly close to them. Yeah. Doesn't matter about the Talon because we're friends, right? We're not enemies, at least. We're we're neutral, sorry. But we're unfriendly towards the Xerats. Yeah. We were hostile, but that ticked up to unfriendly. And now it's going to sit there until we do something. Ah, well, I think we need to go for a swim really quick. We'll grab our... 
this with us and we're going to start cooking here really quick. So that's fine. We'll see how hot the water is. We'll see how hot the water is. I can see I can see seaweed down there. And yay, the the water is nice and cool. So here let's free up our hands so we can swim. And why is it doing that weird there we go. <laughs> Oh, uh, I don't want to waste all my stamina, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to jump out of the water, kind of cook myself a little bit. Just let my jetpack build up. And there we go. That looks like it's going to be down into seaweed here. Perfect. Okay. So let's pick this stuff. And what else do we got here? We've got, uh, what is that? Alien, Alien Plasma T6. Okay, perfect. Okay, pick it then. Thank you. Oh, I got to get lower. That's what's going on. That's what's going on. It's getting deep. Okay, what is our... Yeah, see, we're not that far off. 3,000. Um, and we're getting, what, 50-something? 51. So, 10. We need 60. Pick 60 things. Well, I don't think I'm going to subject you guys to that painful experience. <laughs> um... Yeah, I think what I'm going to do is we're going to call the episode here. I just wanted to show you guys what it looks like down below here. Uh, now, the plant protein, what I should start doing right now. Now, this isn't going to spoil. This will, as you can see, 23 minutes. But what I can do is I can start turning that into energy bars right away. So I'm just going to queue up just mass pile of it. And I'll just let them stockpile in my suit until uh, I need to eat them really because they don't seem to spoil if you leave them in the output of the uh, survival constructor of your suit so that's kind of interesting unless they unless they fix that but it was it wasn't spoiling in experimental so I'm I'm assuming it's still not spoiling Wow, you can see how much uh, XP we're just flying up to, and all the uh, protein. Yeah, see, we're almost there. We're we're almost there, actually. You know what? I, I, I guess I am subjecting you guys to the uh, <laughs> to me leveling up by picking this stuff. But you know, it's it's part of the game part of the game um, you don't have to do this but this will give us a huge stockpile of uh, protein bars and that's that's the main reason I'm doing this not not to actually level I'm actually I need the I need the freaking protein so we'll just pick a few more we'll uh, we'll, we'll pick till we hit level seven I How's that? And once we hit level 7, we'll be able to make a bunch more stuff. Uh, I believe that we'll, we can unlock the drill at level 7. I think. There we go, level 7. Okay. So let's... Uh, oh, we should take some oxygen here. You can see we've just got a ton, ton of the protein. So that's fine because I've got a ton queued up. So eat one right now. There we go. Awesome. We are looking good. We are looking good. Our stats are looking good. Uh, I'm a little surprised that right off the bat it's already queued up an attack 
for in less than 10 days. I mean, I, I almost always set my difficulty too hard for drone base attacks and I haven't seen it be that rigorous <laughs> or uh, quick about it. Um, other than on a custom planet that I made. That was a alien planet. And it, it triggered off pretty quick too, but yeah, that's fine. That's fine. We'll deal with it. We'll have to um, add a, add the constructor and the cargo container, and it'll want us to build defenses for it after that. So we'll do all that, and yeah. Oh, there we go. Look at we're protected. I don't know how that happened, but <laughs> and the sun's about to go down, so perfect timing. Uh, I'm going to call it an episode here. Uh, we've got the the bones of the base started. Um, let that charge up. I'm not going to bother turning it on right now. What's it? It's only got a very small output. Well, it's got some battery juice into it now, so that's perfect. Well, next episode, we'll probably continue with the base. I need to get some more rock, so that'll be probably what we go do. We'll go smash a, a rock pillar over there or something. That'll give us plenty. That'll give us more than what we can carry. So, And then we can finish off at least the – maybe sealing this in, putting in a larger constructor. Um, yeah. So awesome. Well, guys, I'm going to leave it here. Until next episode, you guys have yourselves an awesome, awesome day.